Hello guys, welcome back. In today's video, we are going to learn some advanced tooltip tricks that will be very useful if you are working with visuals like charts and metrics. So let's go to PBA and get started. Here is the PBX file and as you can see here, we have a clustered bar chart and a matrix. And if I go back to the data, so I have a very basic data here. I have a column called as business type and couple of months and I have three years and summer cost revenue and profit. So now if I hover over this visual, by default, I get the year and also the, the cost if I'm hovering over the cost bar and revenue if I hover over the revenue and similarly the profit if I hover over the profit bar. And similarly with the metrics, I get the default settings. So now assume that you, if you want to see the trend of, let's say revenue for the period 2019 till December. So I have a trick to show this. So what is the trick? So let's go create a new sheet here and then name this as tooltip one. First I'll change the page properties. I'll go to the page settings, page information. I'll turn this on, tooltip turn it on and go back to the page size. I'll change this to tooltip. So these are the two settings I am going to make to the page. And then I will insert a line chart. So let me increase the size so it covers the entire page. Okay. And then let me bring in the month to the axis. I don't need this hierarchy, so I'll change this to month. And then I'll bring in the revenue to the values and then the cost and finally the profit. So I don't need this title, so I'll go to the properties and then turn it off. So now we have the trend or a period of time. So now if I go back to the first page here, and then if I hover over this, I still see the old tooltip. So to change this, I'll select this visual, click on this visual, go to the properties, and then we have an option called tooltip. Expand this icon and type report page. And then there will be two options, auto and tooltip. So I'll change this from default to report page and then page tooltip. And now if I hover over this, okay, Oops, why it's not showing up? Let me see. Tooltip, type. Let's see now. Okay, so now it's coming up. So similarly, I can do the same thing for this metrics, select this visual, go to the metrics, tooltip, expand this. Sometimes by default, it will be, it'll show as default, something like this. So you can click on this, expand this report page and then there are two options, auto and tooltip. I'll select the tooltip one. That's my tooltip page. And now if I hover over this, I should be able to see the trend. So when I select 2021, I should be able to see Jan till April. So because I have only four months here. And then if you are publishing this PBX to the service, you, what you can do is you can hide this page so that the others, other users won't be able to see, but however, they should be able to see this trend line. I hope this video was helpful and thanks for watching.